Is it back further? Does it matter? Well, obviously that'll make an impact. Oh. <laughs> What, what up, up guys? guys and welcome back to our channel and today's video is teaching my boyfriend slang terms in 2016 and 2017 so instead of this big intro let's just get into it oh no i wrote a list of slang terms in this notebook i knew some of them and i didn't know some of them i'm gonna see if dave knows any of them are you ready to i'm ready <laughs> <laughs> this is the list I could see it in the <gasps> camera. Don't look! I'm <laughs> just kidding, I couldn't read it. He's such a cheater. Oh my god. All right, I wrote him down 10 that I think he won't know, but I did a total of 16, five he may know, and a bonus one. Let's see how many he gets. Ready? Hopefully I'll get at least a C. <laughs> Number one, low key, high key. Well? Do you know the definition? Low key, I believe, is to keep something like hush hush, like quiet. High key is to, like blow up this like someone's spot or like you know like advertise that. Is he right? Let's see. Low key. Did anyone write the definition? <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, I did. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Low key means people say this when they are about to say something they don't want everyone to know about. High key is the opposite. Boom, I was right. Kind of. Not now, right. what are you talking about? You, it's not, you weren't accurate, like 100%. Yeah, I was. It's not like interview style. It has to be this way because I'll see the damn notes. Okay, when I do it this way, then you look in the camera when you're trying to figure out what it is. Okay, but That's I get why it's better answers now when I look at your face. That was supposed to be cute. Oh. And you ruined it. <laughs> you had like such a look of disappointment when I said that. What the hell? Oh, oh. Number two. Thought. A little slot. Kind of. But what is what's thought mean? Female that gets passed around. Thought is definitely a hood rat. It's just a new term for it. Thought means that hoe over there. Number three. What does ratchet mean? Ratchet? 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 What does it mean? Whorish. Or slutty. Is that your final answer? Yes, ma'am. Ratchet means used to describe look or behavior. Well, that's not the definition from Urban Dictionary. Yeah. We're not looking at the definition of Urban Dictionary. Oh. We're looking what the kids say today. This is teen slang. Then how do you get definitions? Everywhere on the Today Show, it was a video about it and it was a newscast about it. What kids say? It doesn't have to well, be grammatically thank, correct. Thank you for giving me a point of reference. You're welcome. Can't. Cause you're not gonna, you can't use your phone. You don't no, have a life. No shit. I mean. <laughs> no shit, you evil soul. <laughs> I mean a landline or whatever that I thing I don't have is. a life. <laughs> he doesn't have a life. Number four. What does tea up mean? Oh. So from now on folks, we will not be doing interview stuff. Yeah, it's weird. Tea up. Is it like square up? What does square up mean? When you're about to like fuck someone up. No. Hold on, let me think, let me think. Answer. Let me think, no. Is that like the one that's like piss off and like... No, not, that's not the one you like. Tell them the word you like. Oh yeah, city. T up is the new term for turn up. That is so lazy. I know, kids nowadays My are God. even abbreviating the slang that we abbreviated back in the day even more. Well. Yeah, okay. What does... What does GOAT mean? Greatest of all time. You knew that one? Yeah. I did? Yeah. How did you know that? Because I've heard it before. I was eating a cheeseburger in the calf. The and these kids came in like screaming like GOAT and like making like animal noises. One of the kids at one of the booths was like, what are they doing? And the kid in the booth the with him was like, you don't know what a GOAT is? It's like greatest of all time, you moron. And I was just eavesdropping and I picked it up by and chance. You're like, oh, I'm 30. No. What does curve mean? Sentence. Definitely a <laughs> sentence for that one. Girl, you need to just curve him. Or like, girl, curve him. Is it like putting someone in check? Like, no, okay, I'll like say Like, curve him like... it's the opposite of accept. Reject. Exactly. Girl, you need to curve him. Reject him? Yeah, reject someone romantically. I don't really know how to... R-E-J-E-C-T. Curve is C-U-R-V-E. They're so goddamn lazy they shaved off one letter. Yeah. <laughs> lazy. 
Easy. <laughs> Do they know what curve actually means? A curve. Our team not like today, or college. Kids not like where people are like deuces play. and just like split. The next one. This number is number seven. This is not what you think it means when you're gonna. When I say all right, it. all right, let's go. What does snatched mean? <laughs> Girl, that outfit is snatched. Maybe like trendy, the latest thing or something like that. Yeah. I remember like when they were like, my eyebrows on fleek. I didn't know what that meant either. It means like they're perfect. So snatch me describes anything on point. It's the new on fleek. Can't they just say on point? Yeah. <laughs> it's so much easier than saying snatched. It's not even <laughs> well, grammatically, it's snatched. not even grammatically correct snatched. depending on the context. <laughs> but if you say, because if you say that snatched, it's not. Is it snatch or is it it's snatched? snatched. Like, because like, like ED. spell it. ED. Snatch with an ED. Okay. So you say, girl, look at that snatch. They're going to be offended. So they or use like, an girl, ED. that shit is snatched. Yeah. Yeah. If you use that in the wrong context, <laughs> it's going to be so bad. It's an acronym. OTP. It has to describe like a couple. OTP. Mm -hmm. Play. I have no damn idea. I don't know. All right, so OTP means one true pair. That is lame. And that is basically someone who like idolizes a couple, being like, like us, we're one true pair. Help me, help me folks. Know. Help me folks, I need an adult. Hello YouTube. Next word is AF. AF? Yeah, another acronym. Ah, uh, fuck. I don't know. As fuck. Like. Oh, I was pretty close. Yeah, yeah like, uh, man, I'm cool drunk as fuck. fuck. Yeah. No one just say cool AF. Stop looking. He keeps peeking. What does ship mean? Shit? Ship. Number 10. Ship. Ship. Maybe things are big? I don't know. <laughs> In a sentence, please. I totally ship them. He has no idea. Dislike or do without or maybe like. Like set, like get rid of. Is that your final answer? Yes, yes, damn it. Like I want to know what okay. the answer is. The answer is short for relationship. If you ship two people, you want them to make it as a couple. This generation is all about abbreviating abbreviations. Wow. What? Yeah, it's nuts. These damn millennials. You're one of them, baby. You are too. I know. Anybody before 1980 is not a millennial. That's cool, I yeah. All right, you Stop thought. Stop picking. All right, you <gasps> thought. He just called me a hoe. I did not. I'm gonna sh shit me. No. Thanks. I'm gonna shit, gonna shit on you. <laughs> <laughs> so the next few ones you might know, except for 15. So now we're on number 11. Basic. Maybe like mediocre, average. Mainstream in a negative way. Yeah. There's nothing good about being average. There's yes. Nothing if good you are average, about get being off your normal. Embrace the weirdness. You damn right, folks. Um, <laughs> I was just assaulted, <laughs> and it was on, on camera. camera. Next word, savage. Savage. Yeah. Sentence. I'm looking so savage tonight. I've heard them use it and in they different just say, contexts They, they just at always school. say like, you're savage. Like, you're so savage. Or like, that's savage. That's savage. Like, yeah, crazy? Ass. Kind of. Badass. Wow, I hear that a lot. Oh, they must think I'm a badass. Tonight. They call you savage? They say it to a lot of the shit I say. Oh, they say that's savage? Yeah. Oh my god. The next word is number 13. What is the definition of lit? Lit, like, yeah, like that like, party was lit. Awesome, yeah, you're right. <laughs> you know, of this. Number 14. What is <laughs> what does baking mean? I don't know. I'm gonna bake your face until you're looking so fly. Like, I'm gonna putting on makeup, yeah, something like that. Baking means translucent powder that sits on your face for five to ten minutes. I wouldn't have gotten the answer either way. Number 15. What does Hundo P mean? 100%. Yeah. 
100% confirming that was correct and that's the exact definition of what I just said. Here's a bonus question. Looks like I got the one you didn't think I was gonna get. What does shade mean? Oh, usually um, a tree casts it and you lay under it on a nice hot summer day. <sighs> <laughs> Maybe something like shady, like sketchy, or like... Kind of, but that, that's not the correct definition. And enlighten us uh, all. Shade means calling out somebody in the public. So whenever you hear people talking about celebrities, like, she threw uh, shade on her. Yeah, like that. that's interesting. Yeah. I would have never guessed that. I know. 